Hi guys, today I'm going to be showing you how you can enhance freckles in Photoshop. And I'm going to start right now. Hi guys and welcome back to the channel. I hope you guys are safe and well. My name is James and if it is the very first time to this channel and you want to learn all about Photoshop, Lightroom and everything photography related, start now by subscribing and hitting the bell so you don't miss anything. So in this tutorial guys, I'm going to show you how you can enhance freckles in Photoshop. Now this is a great effect, especially if you maybe shot on location or in a studio. So do take that into consideration if you're thinking about applying this effect. Now if you want to have a look at the pre-selected photo that I'm going to be using in this tutorial, then go ahead to the link in the description. But without further ado guys, let's get started. Right guys, so the first thing you want to do is go ahead and choose a photo. And today I'm going to be choosing this photo which I got from unsplash.com and the link will be in the description. So what we want to do today is we just want to enhance the freckles on this girl's face. And we can do this simply by creating just one adjustment layer. So what we want to do is go ahead to our adjustment layers icon in the bottom right hand corner, it's the circle one. We want to click and we want to go to black and white, which is found near the middle. Now you might have seen this a little bit odd changing it into black and white, but what we're gonna do is just simply change the blending mode and it will make sense in a second. So what we're going to do is go to make sure we've got our black and white layer selected and we want to go to our blending mode options which is found just above, it should be called normal. We're going to click and we're going to go down to all the way to the very bottom where you can see it says luminosity. And as you can see the photo has returned back into colour. Now what luminosity does as a blending mode is it converts the effect to change the brightness of each colour. So instead of converting it into black and white we're able to use this as a way of changing the brightness of each colour band. So, well, as you can see, again, it's broken into a bunch of color bands as it is with black and white. And each, we, what we want to do is change the reds and yellows as they're predominantly found in the skin tones. And this is where we can really start enhancing the freckles. So with our yellows panel here, what we're gonna do is we're gonna drag it over to the left-hand side. And as you can see, it is really bringing out the freckles, especially on the girl's face. And again, because reds is also found in the skin tones, we can also lower that ever so slightly. Lovely. But as you can see, it's affecting the entire image, especially the girl's hair, the background, and especially her jumper. And we don't want that to necessarily be affected. So what we need to do is create a layer mask for this effect. So we're gonna go over to our layer mask, which is got with our layer, um, black and white layer. We want to press Command I, and what this will do is it will invert the layer mask from white to black, allowing it to be completely transparent. And then what we can do is we can zoom into the girl's face, we can use the brush tool, which is B on your keyboard, or you can always find it on the left-hand side tools panel. We want to make the brush fairly small, but we want to make it nice and soft. We also want to lower the flow. So we can go to our flow option right at the top, and we're gonna lower it down to around 10%. And then what you want to do is wherever you want the freckles to be enhanced, you can just paint. So make sure we've got white as our foreground color, and then we can just paint over the subject. And as you can see, it is enhancing the freckles without affecting the rest of the photo which is perfect lovely so we can just paint around until you are happy with the result so i'm going to add a little bit more here add a little bit up here lovely now if you're still wanting the freckles to be a little bit more enhanced you can always add a brightness and contrast layer so we're going to go down to our adjustment layers icon, we're going to go to our brightness on contrast, which is this section here, and all you'll need to do is just ever so slightly increase the contrast until you are happy with the result. So I think for this particular image, I think around 40% works perfectly. Brilliant. So if we do the before, and then we do the after, wow, those freckles are really enhanced, and it adds a lovely amount of depth to this image. Brilliant. And there we go, guys. Brilliant, and there we go guys. So that is how you can enhance freckles in Photoshop. Again guys, if you want to like, comment, and subscribe to my channel, it really, really does help my channel grow. Also, if you want to hit the bell notification, so you don't miss any of my latest content. 
Also guys, if you're thinking about picking up some great Photoshop actions, Lightroom presets and photo overlays, then go ahead to my Etsy account and you'll be able to download and purchase them from there. But until next time guys, keep creating. Thank you.